Logic can be met with logic, while illogic cannot. It confuses those who think straight. The big lie, monotonously repeated nonsense, have more of an emotional feel than logic and reason. While the people are still searching for a reasonable counterargument to the first lie, the totalitarians can assault them with another. <laughs> oh, man. Propaganda and the rise of social media. Never before in history have such effective means existed to manipulate a society into the psychosis of totalitarianism. Smartphones and social media, television and the internet, all in connection with bots that spread propaganda and algorithms that quickly censor the flow of unwanted information. Yeah, they're probably not going to want you to get this. When alone and lacking normal interactions with friends, family, and co-workers, an individual becomes far more susceptible to delusions for several reasons. We're talking about isolation, stay at home. Firstly, they lose contact with the corrective force of the positive example. For not everyone is trickled by the machinations of a ruling elite. And the individuals who see through the propaganda can help free others from the menacidial assault. But another reason that isolation increases the efficacy of menacide is because, like many other species, human beings are more easily conditioned into new patterns of thought and behavior when isolated. Friends, do you see this from 10,000 feet looking down? Do you see what we've been going through? Next paragraph, freedom of thought is eliminated. Alone, confused, and battered by waves of terror, a population under an attack of menacide descends into a hopeless and vulnerable state. The never-ending stream of propaganda turns minds once capable of rational thought into playhouses of irrational forces, and with chaos swirling around them and within them, the masses crave a return to a more ordered world. When gradually or suddenly reason and common human decency are no longer possible in such a system, there is only a pervasive atmosphere of terror and projection of the enemy imagined to be in our midst. The society turns on itself, urged on by ruling authorities. <laughs>